What are your alternatives to investing? I mean, in markets in general, stocks, bonds, right? What What are your alternatives if you have? Uh, and it depends on on the nature of. Well, the no, you mean right? in life? I thought like what you have choices and where are you going to put your money? Yeah, yeah. Things like like or will you stuff it in your mattress? Mattress. Will you put it in the bank? Bank. Or will you invest it in some way? Those are sort of the main. Maybe choices, real estate. Right. So yeah, sure. And, and real estate is a is a perfectly viable option for many folks that are comfortable investing in real estate. Now, but that would, comes that comes with some serious uh, uh, maintenance and just paying attention. You become a landlord in some ways. It's another job. It's another job. It's another job, and or it is something that you have to already have experience and comfort with. Right. I mean, there are definitely people out there, and you've had them on your show, that yeah. are lifelong real estate yes. investors and that are very good at it, and they understand the business very well. Right. So, if that person all of a sudden walked into a million dollars or an extra million dollars, they may be able to find very productive investment uses for that money in what they know best, which is real estate. Yes. I would never suggest that, you know, if they were to tell me that's what I intend to do and I'm not going to invest in stocks, I wouldn't say, well, you're, you're up the creek. Right. You know, I'd say, okay, well, obviously you have a comfort there. I may make the case that maybe you don't want to put literally all of your money right. in real estate. Right. Diversify right? it. Exactly. That there's, there is more to the investment landscape than just real estate. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I, for, for somebody that isn't going to go into real estate or let's, you know, let's say it's a much smaller sum of money right that isn't realistic to put into real estate then what would you do or if you just have the say 10 grand cash flow right so you're making 10 grand you're probably not going to put in real estate right no ten ten thousand dollars right i mean what can what real estate can you buy at it's least very, around here yeah very difficult you know it's yeah it doesn't go very far so that then what are your alternatives right you know and, the and you're saying are, generally tend to lose money the mattress, the, the mattress bank. The mattress is a slow leak of your money. The right. bank is also a slow leak of your money for most deposit accounts now. Right. Right? So a slow leak meaning that inflation will eat the value yes. over time. Yes. So stocks have had the best track record of improving your purchasing power over right. time. Right. 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 So, so as far as I'm concerned, and that's frankly, you know, that's one of the, one of the very positive aspects that our market system affords to all of us here, right? Is the opportunity to participate in a market that has been growing and very dynamic and very productive for the benefit of everyone that can participate in it. Now that's not to say that everyone can easily participate in the stock market and that this is a piece of cake, uh, but it is, you know, uh, for folks that have pensions, their pension funds are invested in the stock market. But no, it kind of is easy, especially with like Robinhood and free trades, and it's, it's like gotten anyone easier. can just download. And you're right, it's gotten easier. It's if, not you, if like, you're a citizen, I feel like with a social security number, you should be investing. It's just investing is not what it used to be, which is just sort of a, a rich person's game. Correct. Right. That's that's the point I like to make. Mm -hmm. And the other point I like to make is like we do participate in this dynamic market that we have in this country. This is probably one of the only countries in the world. You come to this country, you want to be here because you can make money while you're sleeping. If you have money in this market, you better believe that the government, the way our government is set up, and I always say this, is looking for every possible way to keep that market going up.